All right. This has been forever, so forgive me if I'm a little rusty, but I'm Zachary Bishop, and this is Better Than Best, the channel, not me. Well, yes, me. But uh, the title of the video is I Drink More Water. Yes. Okay. Now, um, this is just a, a quick video on basically living healthier, but in uh, more focused at drinking water. Okay. Now, in this video, I'll tell you why it's a problem not to be drinking so much water or like the amount of water that you feel that you should be drinking everybody's different and and i'll give you a solution on how to help you uh improve your water intake and just things like that uh, it's not a born <laughs> no it's good okay it i do have a reason for why i'm making this video okay so uh for a lot of people drinking water is not such a priority and it can be a task which i've been there i'm not just you know just here i was there okay uh i used to me personally a little backstory i used to be drinking uh those 44 ounces uh, of dr pepper and they were like a dollar dollar like a dollar and a quarter at a gas station that was like right next to my house so i had at least and i mean at least one and then i started having no ice in it I swear to God, I had no ice in it. And it was just, it was crazy. And even though the signs were there that I should really cut down on it, I just, I was a bit younger then and I just did not care at all. And I would take four ibuprofen a day at least. And that's, that's not okay. And then, you know, after 20 minutes, my headache was gone and I'm just still drinking Dr. Pepper. Believe me, Dr. Pepper is good, but after drinking it for so long and then stopping for so long, it's like I could maybe have a sip and be like, eh, but like almost never. Sorry if it's shaking a little bit. I'm sorry if it's like loud or whatever. I hope the wind's not too bad. But uh, then I started thinking of like how much better I wanted to be because I started going into a spiritual awakening and I wanted to be, you know, better than my best or better than the best, however you like to look at it. And I mean, you really think about it. There are a lot of health problems, long-term and short-term. And the biggest thing I, uh, I figured out or I learned was that over time, not drinking enough water, I mean like going days without drinking water, can really take a toll on your body, uh, your bodily organs, and especially like heart and flow of oxygen to all of your organs. There's so many things. You literally like look it up if you're not like 100% with me on this. But it's you don't have to be a scientist to know. You don't have to research these things to know. You need water to live, and a good amount at that. And not even just for your body also mental things like being able to focus and like i said before those headaches and just lots of lots of things for your brain and it oh it, it would make things hard to focus so i think of, i thought of why i really want to do this why do i need to be healthy like yeah we're all gonna die someday okay but while we are alive while we are you, you might as well take care of your body because you want to live the best life possible. I mean, isn't that what everybody wants? It's not exactly the same thing for everybody, but we all want to live in a better life. Uh, once I started, once I really started doing that, God, I was so healthy. I was like, I'm, I'm healthy now, but I was just flowing with it and I was doing the very best that I could at that time. And it was like, It was nothing but water. It was nothing but salads or I was cooking something with good vegetables. In the morning, I was eating fruits and just only water all the time. Like really, and that's that's all I ever did because I use, you know, I use my mind and I was like, yeah, I I know what healthy is and I want to be healthy. So I started so I really started doing that and god, I felt so amazing. Just waking up every morning early as hell just doing whatever i wanted and that was like that consisted of drinking water immediately <laughs> doing yoga and just all throughout the day i always had a water with me 
and of course it's different for everybody else you may already be just fine so obviously this video isn't for you but this is for the people that know that they don't drink water so much or they don't even care that they don't drink water and i've been there and i understand that but in the back of your mind you know your higher self is like come on man <laughs> uh so after i did that and i started like getting off track because i was just flowing with it i wasn't really having a set plan or doing anything like that but now that i have been consistent and i am doing these things uh all the time uh i have methods and ways of doing that uh first off one of the the second thing i do every time i wake up is drink water whenever you are whenever you're sleeping for so long you're dehydrated you will you will get dehydrated because you've been laying there for what six to 12 hours depending on you know what your what your sleep schedule is like i usually sleep uh at the most eight at the most eight unless i'm unless i'm dumb the night before but uh drink water immediately as soon as you wake up and your body will thank you okay <laughs> Uh, I also got a drink water reminder. If you have iPhone or if you have any phone, you can set a reminder for it to go off like hourly or whatever. And you can put it to whatever you want. But I I could do that. But I instead I set uh, instead I got an app that actually tracks my water, and I haven't been tracking my water because I it's just I know how much water I'm drinking. I just remember. But I got an app, and it's like uh, it's it's literally a like drink water reminder and it's i mean i'm sure there's a thousand of them but i just got one of those and i actually didn't even use like it says drink water i just put like i am living healthy and i don't necessarily drink water every time it goes off i have it go off every hour and a half and i don't drink water every single time i just i just it subconsciously programs me to be like hmm sometimes i think about it whenever like just throughout the day like before the alarm goes off and I, I use that to really start getting on my ball to be like, I need water, <laughs> drink water. It is good because your body will always tell you, you have to listen to your body and your body will always be like, you're dehydrated and then you'll drink water. But it's also good to, you know, drink water even when you don't need it because uh, you need that flow going through your body always, constantly, especially if you're drinking other things like teas. Teas aren't too bad, but like sodas and stuff like that. <laughs> It's so obvious. It's so black and white. Like what's good for you is dark. What's good or what's bad for you is dark. What's good for you is white or light. And water is just exactly that. Uh, I mean, sci I mean, most people know this, but uh, uh, health researchers say that we should be drinking two liters or uh, eight, eight, eight fluid ounce bottles of water or like half a gallon of water every single day. And that's that's about what I drink. But it's different for everybody. If you're not doing that much, just do a little bit at a time. Don't kill yourself. Honestly, drink water to where uh, like you want to drink more. And then you will start picking it up. Don't kill yourself and don't like rush it and drink like a whole bunch of water for the like for the next three days and then just be like ah, I'm tired of it. I don't want no water. Be consistent, do it little by little. Uh, so I believe if you set a reminder for yourself, that will start the habit easily. I mean, we have technology. Why not use it to improve your life? Um, and this is, and honestly, this goes for more than just, oh my God, this is a long video for, for water, but I mean, all of it's knowledge. Okay. So just hear me out. Uh, this is water is, you know, essential for us to survive, but it's more than just for our body and mind. It's also for your soul. If you if you are someone if you're spiritual or whatever religion you follow you do under you you do understand that you are not your thoughts and you are the person that is observing it all you are the astute observer in this whatever we want to call it right so doing this brings you back into alignment with your soul you're able to see these things and you'll be able to love yourself and you're you'll be able to shift into that positivity that you may want i'm not gonna say that we all want because i don't know but that's, a, that's like a whole nother subject but i do believe that it realigns you with your soul i believe that it brings you back into that 
that piece of not being just a robot subconscious all the time. So if you need any more motivation, ask why to yourself. Ask yourself why, or just text me now. <laughs> but for real though, but for real, ask yourself why. Like, it's not just, I want to be healthy. It's why do I want to be healthy? Well, I want to run with my dog. I want to, I want to start getting fit. I want to start exercising every day. I want to focus. I want to be it. There's a countless amount of things, but there is only one person that can come up with your personal why, and that's you. I think that was like way incorrect grammar, but it's okay. But know your why. And once you know your why, that's that's motivation for yourself, and that's all you need. Once you want it, you will get it. I swear to God. And like I said, set a reminder. I believe a reminder really, really helps being consistent. Honestly, that's how I'm consistent with everything that I do. I just have reminders. And then that's how I got started being consistent with everything I do. I mean, remind yourself. Sorry, I'm shaking. It's honestly like kind of cold right now. Wuss. And after you have your why and you have the motivation and you start, start on your journey of being consistent, you will start feeling the results. Trust me, you will feel it. And then just appreciate and then just keep on doing you. Honestly, I love that. Uh, thank you guys so much for everything, honestly. And I'm going to be more consistent, way more consistent. I mean, this is like the beginning of something else, honestly. Um, check out the description. Uh, my socials are down below the, below the text. If you guys want to like, talk or like what's up or like send me some memes no <laughs> just do that and i would like love to talk to you guys i like i'd really appreciate it and uh if you if you don't want to do that just do comments or whatever but thank you guys you are beautiful and until next time form and flow